welcome this is Gigi and this is a tarot reading from our collective hi you guys I hope you are well yes I am returning again with another tarot reading for you I hope you enjoy it this is a general reading you guys just keep this in mind if it doesn't resonate try not to read too much into it okay leave it all behind so let me just take a moment to thank all of you guys thank you for your support thank you for all your emails everyone far and near near and far i love you so much because we've been together for almost 10 years i think next year will be 10 years and i am so happy that i have my supporters and you guys are really enjoying my work and so thank you for all that you guys i love you so much let's start your reading for my collective and see what the message is Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay. There's some type of ex unexpected expenses coming in uh, for you, but I think it's like home care expenses and it's, it's worth it. And I feel like you shouldn't hesitate at this present moment because the healing is needed. And that could be many things. Maybe a uh, spa weekend, a massage. Uh, any type of treatment that you feel will rebalance your energy it says here that you should invest in it all right sorry confirmation seven of pentacles like whatever expenses or money finances coming out it'll be it'll be coming back in with the seven of pentacles you'll be able to grow back so just don't worry i feel here someone needs some healing and the healing might be time so maybe you have to take time away from work or away from business I hope not away from school, but that could happen, all right? But whatever time or whatever, um, yeah, whatever you'll be, whatever will be missing, okay? Because I think some of you may be absent for some times. You, when you'll come back, you'll come back stronger, all right? And then you'll be able to put the right seed. Something have to be rebalanced. Eight of Pentacles, what's the message, Spirit Guide? Yeah, there's some expenses, unexpected expenses that could have, uh, yeah, the God in a reverse. Ooh, there's some unexpected expenses because of someone unreliable. Maybe you relied on someone that just was not there, was just I'm not sure why relying on other people, but that could happen. Maybe with the Eight of Pentacles, maybe you, you started a partnership with someone or. And this could be some ending and some type of, or I feel like someone, you know what? Someone could try to put an end into your, your endeavor, into your work, into whatever you're doing. All right. Someone who's ashamed and embarrassed. All right. With the eight of pentacles, it could be because of, uh, they're seeing that you have more, uh, maybe your skills are more appreciated, your value, you're, you're, you're more liked than someone else or someone who kind of like has a huge ego all right and they could decide to block you or to delay something that has to do with your work let's go let's dive deeper yeah someone's been hating on you probably because i feel like with the energy in a reverse someone who feels that you deserve them respect and you don't want to give it to them ace of swords yeah you told them the truth straight up you told them all right so <laughs> So there's a situation you'll see how it'll reveal in your life. You let me know. You told the truth about uh, someone who's, let's call a con man, okay? Uh, to a con man, okay, that you know is conning. And eight of pentacles, now they try to severe your work or try to severe something from you here. Healing, at this present moment, it says you are asked to, to heal. And you should be the most important thing. You should be taking the time and energy. And don't worry about doing that because it says whatever is not coming in or whatever the shady little bee trying to stop for you. Seven of Pentacles. It'll, you'll, it says here you'll be in a much better place. Look, this is the Seven of Pentacles is nice. Right? Where, where you're, you'll be more aligned. And you can see the Seven Chakra here. 
on the tree a nice tree all right so the future for some of you if there's some challenges time challenging time and you're like my god the key to the exit is the healing to recenter yourself realign yourself into you what you like what you need sometimes it's peace and quiet that's really refreshing all right <laughs> especially if you're on someone who talks lots of people love to hear themselves talk 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 that takes a lot of energy all right and um all that anyways healing healing is really mostly is there's an energy that is really about yourself it doesn't involve other people there's someone else here that could maybe uh, is the provider here okay but it's something really into pouring into yourself okay tell me more spirit guys for the healing energy ace of pentacles in the reverse all right so you are asked immediately to revalue yourself all right please don't cut yourself short all right, healing is important no matter the situation. You could read any book, speak to anybody. They'll say, well, I was in a... But you need to heal yourself because you're your best bet. All right? So be mindful here if you have any hesitation because, you know, it's, it's always about finance or it's about time. It says here you'll be fine. So it's time to put a lot of energy into having faith. Seven of Pentacles, it says you'll be fine, you'll be in a much better look. Oof. So really, you have water, sun, you'll be in a peaceful place, all right? Healing is required, it says here, for someone. I feel like there's a, I feel like someone might need to distance themselves. Four swords, oh my God, yes, yeah, someone is tired. My collective, someone is tired, all right? You have to rest. Or right, someone in a collective, maybe you're having issues sleeping at night. All right, something is ending. So in a way, there's nothing you can do if you're trying to control the situation. Whatever end of the story you are, oops, tell me how it feels. Okay, I don't know. But the universe is the last card, and it says here something is ending because. Like, again, what's as above, so below. Everything is synchronized. In in this circle, what has to be done or what was supposed to be done is done. So tell me in which area of life that resonates for you, but the universe is done. So no, no need to worry about something that has to take its course on its own, which we have no control. We don't. We don't. Remember, we don't. So if we don't have any control might as well take the time for ourselves right bet on ourselves us first you first especially when i have this healing card in the right position it says here yeah and you'll be maybe you'll have an opportunity like i don't know what that could be uh you know yeah like a massage or uh, spa day, spa weekend, or oh, it's like there's like those special like day, uh, you know, healing centers or wellness centers, whatever. It's time. It's gonna transform you. So I think that between now and let's say like the first week of April, uh, that you do take the time if it resonates for you because. What, what what happened is I feel like some of you might have dealt with a shady character and it's really heavy dealing with a negative energy, especially if you have light, if you resonate light. Most of the time you're going to want to be by yourself, spend time alone because sometimes, you know, dealing with people that are really dark, it's for sure you're going to, the light's going to project that on them. All right. So. They're not going to like you and you're not going to like them because you're going to see right through them. I think what happened is dealing with some a shady character, someone probably really told someone or showed someone the mirror. And it was someone who's uh, with the Ace of Swords. Well, whatever was said, it seems to be true. So especially if you said things that are true. Yeah, I mean... Someone might feel a certain way, but it doesn't matter, right? We have the Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. So 
it doesn't matter because you're 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 standing with the ace of swords is the hand of the most high the hand of god that says yes okay uh but the god here in the card is in the reverse so it did it really does speak about revealing some truth all right uh so truth was revealed i guess it was some harsh truth because someone is very pressed with you my collective there's someone who is really upset with you they want to break your plan they want to uh, take some time from you uh, punish you by taking your money doing something that is detrimental to you they're gonna try to do that but what i see is that that person is very weak themselves because it's in a reverse so the truth oh my god the truth hurts and someone is hurt their little feelings are hurt god in a reverse ace of cups in a reverse because probably you reveal them that you don't respect them you don't you don't care for them ace of cups in the reverse especially because they're shady it doesn't matter how big bad they think they are if internally there's only a peanut right a peanut doesn't it doesn't matter how much water you put out or whatever form you want this to be it's a peanut it's just a peanut that's that's all it is ace of cups in the reverse i'm going to call this reading this reading it's a peanut <laughs> Ace of Swords and Ace of Cups in a reverse. Yeah, you hurt someone's feelings. Could have rejected someone. Maybe you reject someone with a huge, huge, huge ego. Ooh, maybe should you? Maybe there was no reason for them to, but you rejected them. And I mean, sometimes happens. Mostly, uh, you guys let me know. It happens. Be mindful, okay? Because sometimes, you know, the people that you reject especially if they're immature they're gonna try to get back at you okay it's not just like oh starting rumors that's nothing okay is they're gonna try to hurt you all right to put you in a position or uh to have someone else do their work to have someone throw a stone at you and then hide their hand so be mindful ace of cups here you have someone who's feels that uh, they're in a vulnerable position and they are and they are seen okay so i think what, what really is upsetting for whoever you had that conversation or whatever truth was revealed is that other people are seeing them they're seeing them with the rain on them they look tired they're weak they look sick they're very they're a mess and being seen in, in such a matter without the fluff right is something that always oh they're really mad and so now they're be, you're gonna be someone's there's something that has to be let go all right some type of partnership but it's gonna be for the best so let's go for healing yeah because at the end of the day i mean let's go for healing because there's something here it's a major arcana spirit guide Ooh, tower in a reverse yeah so around you chaos meanwhile you have the strength the universe it's over so i think maybe someone could like throw some bombs i think so many things are being revealed like even myself like i i haven't watched television like for years you guys years okay i think the last time it was i had a television i had television now like the last two years but before that it was like 9 11. And the reason why I, I, I did it is because I saw something during that time. I was really young. And it just, I couldn't really go to school after that for a long time because my heart was just, I was, I was it was shattered. So then we decided I was not going to have any television. So I didn't have any television so I could choose what I want to watch and watch and be more. It's very sensitive. Now I'm stronger, right? But at that time, you know, all that to say that, you know, tower in a reverse is, you know, this reality of seeing people and things for what they are and truth being revealed even about history, right? 
Um, it could be still shocking for some, but it's it's just the beginning because the tower is still in the reverse, so it's not fully down, completely down. Maybe the shower has to be crashed. I'm not sure. I'm not sure because the universe is ending. It's about an ending, but something is going to end. Let's, let's clarify the tower, all right? By preventing, someone could prevent something to crash totally, which is a good thing because the tower moment with the eclipse season is harsh. I, I would think it would be harsher. Clarify the tower, spirit guides. La Luna, talking about the eclipse. Yeah. Woof. There's a way to avoid something to be horrible for someone here. Okay, for masculine energy. He has a way to avoid it. But La Luna, I feel like it's up to there's a feminine energy. Like La Luna, it's about showing something into the light. See, when it's dark and there's a full moon, or well, the full moon reflects something. Well, you know how the, the moon is, right? It's so far, but because it's a reflection, we could see it, right? So there's something that was hidden is coming out. Okay, but in a way it's coming out. I'm not sure the tower with the la luna in a reverse is quite a combo that is kind of emotional. All right? But also it has to do with timing. And the time is now. All right? There's no more, I'm saying there's no more wait. It's now. All right? The, the, it's, the season is now. The season is now. I'm hearing okay not much can be done you guys that's what it says nothing could be stopped so don't try to nothing could be stopped things are taking its course right now things that we don't know are taking place yeah it's judgment day it's judgment day some people are in judgment could be a mental prison could they could it could be a physical prison in the card i don't know just reading the cards you guys and you know the way i read the card now I'm, i have a, have to have a very detached way of saying my message because after being online for such a long time and speaking to all of you guys i've seen things i've been told so many things and what i'm saying is, is i get confirmation is, is people come to me to confirmation because they feel that i have enough empathy to listen to them and the secret like my whole business is based on secrecy it's not just i'm calling you to cut it's like people say you know like you said something and blah 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 that's they feel more uh in a trusting hands of a stranger sometimes due to all the backstabbing the betrayal coming from their uh entourage coming from their family their friends of course so now they have to reach out further and out and they reach out sometimes to people online to me i've been doing this reading for years nowadays i do my reading very differently because at the same time i know what i say as harsh because it's it's for me yes i i just i want to sometimes seeing things when people reveal things to me or when i see them to myself i you know they say something it's so true they say you know when when uh when you understand the world you hate the world at the same time when you see the world you hate the world you really want to go home you want to go to the most high you want to go to god because you you're gonna come out just like i said i'm really stoic when i give my reading cold because you're gonna have to see how much what else can i do lord the most high they come to me i'm go doing those readings i know they 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 have a they come to me they need to speak they have a message they need to be this and that free they need to you know have protection help whatever guidance so it's a lot it's a lot you see how this this reading i have to deliver i don't know what energy i'm channeling it's a lot but if i don't do it in a way that it's detached i then i'm not gonna be able to make it i have to sleep at night and yes i sleep at night you guys the good news i do 
I, I, I have strong boundaries. You should too. All right. Where we're going is a, in the next few years with the judgment is going to be a rebalancing of the scale and it's going to be dark because we're not going to have the guidance, not the guidance, but the way of doing things the same way. So we're going to have to be led by fate. And you know what? In 20 years from now, because like, I've been doing reading for almost 10 years, next year, I don't think I'm going to do it much more, you guys. I have other things I want to do. But the way I see it in 20 years from now, it's going to be God consciousness. Now it's spirituality and, and God consciousness. I'm not talking about religion. I'm not talking about Christian, what the, the Bible said. I didn't, I'm not even going into that, okay? I just said God consciousness, okay? And it's, it's really beautiful to see because we want to, we, people want to see the light, you know, even the people that, that do bad things to other people, they themselves want to see the light. But they are so dark, they can't even ask for help. Everybody needs to see the light. We're going to have to work on the light. The light has to be within us and start with consciousness to understand that, yes, there is a lot of things happening and people have different views and visions. However, set a boundaries for yourself, protect yourself. And I just say, I'm not saying all oh, the world. I'm just saying, don't, don't let people finesse you, not even emotionally. All right. This is an experience. This life is an experience and we just have to see it. And we can't be always controlled by what's happening. We have to be detached, try to detach judgment. Things gonna happen. We're gonna see again, mass coming off. Is 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 gonna? Is I don't know if it's gonna make us mad. I think it's gonna make us sad first. Like wow, is that for real? You you gonna see how things doesn't make sense? Like wait a minute, I thought that you. Oh okay okay okay. So it's you. You, all right listen okay judgment <laughs> i'm gonna end this reading guys all that to say that it's a new reality coming in with the judgment here and walking with the light where the light is is going to be the best way to make it through the next 20 years the light is not in on the television the light is in our heart the light is in our head. All right. It could be ignited, ignited with passion and love. If the passion is true, have some passion for your life. Truth. What is truth? Find it. Interest in whatever that is. All right. But that is what will keep us alive is the light. We can no longer have things thinking us. If I do things for the next 20 years. No. For, have a fun, fundamental core in you that's gonna hold you and say i need to see the light seek for the light all the time because we're coming into darkness be into the light the light is coming in your heart from your heart it's true if you see darkness don't stay around dark darkness you don't have to point at darkness just push yourself away from it far away from it because they won't make it. They will not. But you follow the light. If you don't know what the light is, you're not sure how you could reignite the light because sometimes you, your light could be so bright. It could push people away. It doesn't mean you don't have the light. It's just because it shines so bright and there's a lot of people like that. All right, so find people like you where so you could shine together. You, you be a light. So when someone is tired, someone else will pick up the, the work. Like-minded people that are honest, that have clarity, all right? And they have a loving heart is where you should be. I'm going to end this reading here, you guys. It won't be too long. I just want to say I love you so much. If you like this reading, show your support, like and share. Subscribe to the channel. Until next time, send you lots of kisses. I love you.